this is a disaster but we always get to fix it but i'm not gonna fix it here because the whole point of for, guys do you see hey guys do you see what's happening or is it me is the camera focused enough for you to see them go that i'm going through right now hey guys you i'm screaming guys there you see that's the one thing that i don't want that's the problem that we're facing that is another pandemic that we're facing yo it's time to be zipping and doing it okay <laughs> let's go what do you do gang gang what do you do hey what do you do gang gang what do you do hey <laughs> Hi, Bodoi! Like, Bodoi! Like, to anyone who's new to my YouTube channel, I go by the name of Tiamo Sipio. How to know you? How you doing? Guys, regular, regular. Thank you very much, guys. Please, guys, if you're new, do not forget to like, comment, share, and even subscribe. I love that very much. We appreciate it very much. Because you're most definitely welcome, babes. Um, you're probably wondering, well, what are you saying? What are you saying? Guys, as you have seen by the title of the video, guys, you already know what I'm on about today or what I'm giving to you guys. So I've opted that I'm going to give my views on certain things that have been happening. Um, probably touch base on what I've been going through and the most crucial part is that we're going to be reviewing two of my favorite i can't say favorite okay so i'm trying a new <laughs> so i'm trying a new um eyelashes i'm trying new eyelashes which i got um but they're very dramatic so i'm very excited to see how they're gonna sit or sit on me so basically i'm going to be trying two of my dramatic eyelashes um eyelashes you know those that i have to my collection babes so yeah guys please make sure make sure that you take a back seat and let's talk Guys, I see you. I'm not really because I got like good reviews with the whole thing of yo, we like you without the head wrap and all of that. I won't lie, guys, that had to be like one of my insecurities major. Like it affected me for the longest time. And it sort of did not work in my favor in terms of my confidence. Even now, you know, I'm a very I'm very skeptical. I like it more on camera, but I, I doubt that I'd want to be a person that actually get to go outside like this but yeah it's it's a work in progress guys baby steps i mean as i'm just a designer i didn't pick or design myself good in dbs so because i'll be banking other talents i mean i go yo so guys without drumming too much guys so i'd like to show you the lashes that we'll be working with so here's one i'm not gonna try these ones these are still brand new well these ones are also brand new but as you can see i did try them one time and i like them but i am going to try them again so here are the lashes i love them the volume the belt is very light which is another thing i hate having something that's too heavy on my eyes and yeah and here's another bunch drum roll please i've been wanting these for the longest time guys i'm sorry about the light the whole distracting lighting eh? i've been wanting these for the longest time guys yo these ones girl, i'm gonna break the f out of all the toxic relationships in my life listen these ones yo i can't wait to rock them in the groove yo listen without wasting any time guys i'm gonna try and install them and remember you're compromising on this youtube channel so i am unfortunately is it a good thing or bad thing going to have to use bonding glue <laughs> so let's go So guys, I've tried to put one side right. By far, I think I'm sort of happy. Guys, do not mind the alignment because 
I do not really want to put them on my lashes because I'm going to be taking them off and back on. And remember, we're not using a lash glue, we're using a bonding glue. <laughs> a bonding glue. So yeah, guys, let me try another one. As you can see, yeah, bro, I, I love it. it. It it gives me elegance to certain extremes. But then I have to admit, I'm a bit worried about the belt. Yes, it is light, but however, it's light and fragile. So one mistake, literally, you're gonna cut it off. So you don't want that, right? So let's put the other bunch to it. And guys, here's another also um another disadvantage with the bonding glue, right? It gets you um ruin your your especially if like already. How can I explain it? So normally how I do it, right? I'll apply my lashes and then I'll do like final checks in terms of my eyeshadow because you'd find that it is um, either smeared or distorted. So I don't want that to happen. So to avoid that rather, I get to, you know, to go again with the eyeshadow and then that's where also I get to cut my crease because I'm a crease girl. But now, as you can see, like I just have a simple look because I didn't even want to put makeup, but I'm like, ish guys, how is it possible, Tiamo, that you want? How is it possible, Tiamo, that you actually want to to put on lashes? Um, where else you haven't done your makeup? I don't know. I'm no shade to anyone that does this, right? But for me, it's it's very weird. Like I, as I said, no shade to anyone that do, that does it. But to me, it's literally so weird. So I'm gonna try having to put another one. Guys, you'd find that sometimes when you put your lashes there, you see the distorted part, it did touch there, you know? But it's fine, um, we always get to fix that. Guys, sometimes you just need to measure um, the lashes because sometimes you'd find that the belt is a bit long. So for some people, they first measure it, which I feel like it's something that one should do. And then they get to, after having to measure it, they literally get to, side from there and that's where they get to cut it so i'm gonna adjust it on close-up guys yo come on going on around live one no one i'm gonna go what i like about this though it gives you time to adjust it guys please do not mind the smearing this is a disaster that's a disadvantage with how i actually put them on but what i like is that you can always adjust it you know you always can adjust it and another thing happened one time guys like i try to do what i'm doing right now eh? which to myself you see it's happening if you get a closer look you'll realize that the glue actually have uh caught with my um under lashes under the eyelid lashes guys do not mind my eyes i have teary eyes which i take it's what part of sensitive eyes guys this is a disaster but we always get to fix it but i'm not gonna fix it here because the whole point of Fr guys do you see <laughs> Guys, do you see what's happening? Or is it me? Is the camera focused enough for you to see them go that I'm going through right now? Hey, guys. Yo. I'm screaming, guys. There, you see? That's the one thing that I don't want. That's the problem that we're facing. That is another pandemic that we're facing. Yo, what's the woman? The mutant is in Don't go see. Yo, that's how the sasso gola. Because we like things. I wanna know if I'm barakal. I know go go. Oh, and another thing, you see, it's very easy to remove the bonding glue. Literally, scrub it off, and there, it's gone. That's another advantage with this glue. But the thing is, when you now take it, did I even show y'all guys the bonding glue? This is the bonding glue that I'm talking about. It's the Kellington hair bonding glue, guys. This thing. No, Skawara, I see Gorilla vibes. Guys, I gave myself a little more right there. So, guys, I'm gonna try to This is the first try out. Guys, do not mind how shady they look. Oh my god this is the first try out just just get the idea of the dramatic you see on the side 
you'd realize that here i didn't adjust them well guys i'm just gonna quickly take them off i just wanted to show you how they look guys do not find the under lid it's still the glue right there i really hate it when that happens but i always get to fix it before going out because here in this channel we're all for having to look good and clean okay guys look sanitized so yeah guys i really like it though the volume this is your for your elegant type of events guys the kind of events where you know you're not gonna fight you know you just have to be that good hand look beautiful likewise you know represent likewise and you just have to be yourself but i really love them guys look at the side Ibi. Oh, i know ha. so guys i again disclaimer do not mind my Cherry eyes so i'm gonna take these off and then we're gonna try the last bunch so guys as i'm taking them off i'm gonna tell you also something guys if you check out my other videos you'll realize that i've been ranting a lot like literally i've been ranting you know i've been ranting and venting it's not because of i'm doing that out of maybe i want cloud or i want more viewers which i wouldn't mind more viewers however most of the things i'm gonna say most because some of them you know they are not events recent events but um as per my previous video you're gonna realize that everything that i had mentioned was something that was really happening in my life you know and yeah i i found myself in a relationship and just to give you a summary on everything i fell in love with this guy who uh, then got to branch out by branch out he got to see other people which to our agreement i never had a problem but i realized Jorge, i'm not really an open relationship kind of person guys i can't bear the thought of i'm sitting here waiting for you and you are probably with someone else doing lord knows what so i i, I no no it's not for me guys call me selfish call me territorial but guys i am I am yo guys Kimungo. Oh my god, sorry. Honestly, I can't guys. I, I'm bad. I've realized that and I'm not gonna put myself in positions which at the end are going to be things that are literally gonna harm me, you know? But yeah guys, um so the guy cheated of me on me three times. Um the guy and the last cheating it had to be also involved. Let's try these ones. It also had to involve um the part where he also got to impregnate the girl you know so that took place i was hurt i won't lie i was really really hurt but i was like you know what it's fine guys um he also helped me realize how it Ooh. hey guys put it oh now i get it i didn't understand why they had to be Oh, you see, they're so easy when they glue it. Yo, guys, hey, let's put another one. <laughs> hey, guys, hey, 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 wait, 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 I'm not laughing. Wait, guys, give me a chance. Wait, let's maybe the, there's gonna be hope. Hey, guys, and I got these ones for 40, 40 bucks, and I remember this girl tried to sell them. I'm like Mugele, like no independent, you can understand the law, no one can profit, but our happy one got a happy so in charge of law or on your go a stay, you understand? And now you're charging me because now literally, like you wanna you wanna secure the bag, you wanna extend gun now. So, yeah, guys, because I'm trying to get a so I, I got hurt, ne? um he cheated on me three times the third time he got the girl pregnant and that girl wasn't even the girlfriend that girl was a one night stand right and then and then after that guys like it hurt me because prior to that we had spoken that i want children and things like that so i don't know if what he did was to be to spite me because i mean guys you know i can't conceive my options are things like ivf in virtual fertilization which one of my friends did say that if i'm ready he's more than willing to you know bear my kids which i truly appreciate i even cried i remember i cried because wow that is another blessing on its own you know but the thing is i need to be ready as he he said to me right so let me put this on Okay. So this one was easy to glue because already it came with the um with the gluing to it. 
but this other one other one i tried it before because i was going to celebrate my friend's birthday wish there's a story time to that <laughs> but anyways so yeah guys um yo uh uh guys get ill get ill get ill with the hour hi Oh, guys, I go send them, I go send them. You see, you see, it does that I can. I'm not even gonna perfect them. We just want to see the volume of it. That's the whole point. I'm not gonna. Guys, guys. <laughs> Wait, guys, something. Okay. Huh. Oh, I never. Okay, guys, here's the volume. Guys, what do you think? How <laughs> are <laughs> These ones are the kind of lashes that you wear when you're going to break up with a person because you know that you're gonna literally you're gonna fly out of the relationship guys no drama <laughs> guys mo blinko guys guys maro la di bona guys ah guys er ke kwa and then la kwa di So yeah, guys, you know, I took the decision yesterday that I'm going to put myself first. I've been doing a lot of putting other people and I'm going to start being more assertive. Um, affirmation for what? Pambili, team affirmation. Because I've been like an advocate for heartbreak and it's sad because I'm not crying. It's because of these lashes that it seems as if now I'm crying. But guys, the drama of these lashes. I can't deal and what's oh, the, uh, another thing is that I feel like they even um I don't know man I think they need someone with big eyes maybe they'll work in their favor but for me no for me to no. I'd rather go with the first one guys maybe I'm not used to them but no guys this is too much guys look at the volume <laughs> and then I feel like they even guys they overpower the brows and that's how my brows are big guys what in the mugo is happening <laughs> guys, born. Eh? Even if maybe I want to try a bunny and a girl, okay, let's bunny on it, bunny on it. Uh, guys, no, this is too much. I don't know. I, I, mm -mm. it's not for me. I, I'm li literally gonna give them away because I have a friend that's that's a baddie, Angela. How you doing? Ah. But no, now they don't for me. I'm gonna give them away. Ah, guys, you keep going and a like I try thinking or if I don't get to give them away, I might just try to reduce them to cut them and only hope that I don't get to ruin them because I feel like also one you see here I almost ruined it because you can see that the pattern here or is it how they install them? I don't know what's the deal there. But I feel like no they too much. I'm sorry. Like I tried guys. I tried y'all are my witnesses. Like literally when I close my eyes guys and that time imagine you, you bump the plug. Yo So yeah guys I just to wrap up thank you very much for having you this far um so yeah guys i decided that i'm going to choose myself for a change um i'm going to prioritize myself even when it hurts guys heartbreak hurts like heartbreak actually the ending of relationships hurt you know i had to mourn a relationship where i was like what close friends with these two uh ladies and then things happen and we no longer got to see eye to eye but today i'm just good with one and the other one is just i tried to rekindle things and i'm like i can't force it guys i tried you know fail fail in doing something knowing that you have tried like literally guys i tried and it never worked and also um yeah but and also relationships they they really hurt especially when they have to come to an ending guys and the last one with my boyfriend it really hurt me because to this day i i don't want to lie to you guys i still like the guy um and it's so weird that i find myself to a position or in a position that i cannot even try to fight 
you know i can't i i feel like i've had my fair show of having to try and fight for the relationship but that's the thing like i fought to a point where i felt that there was nothing else on my end that i could do you know and despite the fact of everything that he put me through i still chose to love him you know but then the minute you started to involve the baby part i was like okay i could i don't know maybe this is my naive self saying this but then i felt that i could forgive cheating because i'm not that very strict on a guy having to do not cheat on me and that no i'm not that strict but then i'm very big on respect like respect me and i will respect you it's basically relationships are basically like a two-way street you know and yeah that's what basically happened guys you know mm -hmm. But yeah, guys, um, enough with the soft stories. Hopefully, this is the last time I get to even start to, you know, discuss heartbreak. Hopefully, this is, I pray that hopefully this is the last time. And I pray that God does eventually bring someone who's more capable and loving with good intentions for me. And yeah, guys, that's just about it. Oh my God, guys. Like yesterday I was crying. Yesterday I remember I was with the gent. Um, and I had a lot of questions. But the thing is. Me having a lot of questions. Um, still left me. With more rhetorical questions. You know. And sometimes even though you know what the answer will be. You still want to hear. Hear it from that person. So that maybe to you. You might get like a proper understanding of how is it you know of how they feel towards you like there's nothing that hurts for like having to be in a relationship and you realize that you are the only person who is in love with that relationship guys i don't choose i don't get to really decide for my heart as to who to fall in love with yes the fact that we're going to pursue or start something that should be one of the triggers to it but i don't get to choose who i get to fall in love with and the disadvantage that comes with me is that when i love i love hard like i love hard and and it hurts like it hurts guys it hurts i'm sorry to be crying on camera but i have to be honest with you like it really hurts it really hurts so bad because in all in most of the relationships that i've been in i've been a person to ask myself like how did we get here tell me what is it that you're not doing right is it the kind of people that you're attracted to or is it just because of you just too kind or you too inviting what's the deal i don't i understand i'm still young chances are this is probably not my last heartbreak but now my biggest fear is what if now i do not ever get to fall in love again what happens if i do not get to fall in love again or every time i get to involve myself in a relationship i i already assume that it's gonna come to an end i do not want to be that kind of a person and in the process i also do not want to get to be a person that gets to lose myself but yeah guys hopefully hopefully this is the last one uh i'm done like I'm really done guys, I really want to close this chapter in my life and I want to start having to work in building myself, you know, and having to empower myself, also empowering other people and I just want to prioritize myself more, you know, including my feelings, you know, and yeah guys, that's just about it guys, I'm really sorry, I am so sorry, I am so sorry guys, um, I hate showing emotions on camera because like I feel like I've made it to a point where I've made my YouTube channel about the whole let's jolly, let's get together, let's laugh, but I'm also human guys. Um I'm not perfect and I'm sure even in relationships I do have my flaws but yeah I just hope things are different, you know. But anyways, guys, I hope to see you on my other content creations. Okay, guys, I love you so very much. Okay, bye. Please make sure to subscribe. Okay, bye. I forgot. I forgot.